Oh, my gloves tore yesterday, so bought me some new $10 gloves. I mean, these will work fine. And today, I'm going to be working on the, on the basket for the wood. And I already got most of my angle iron cut out. I got two pieces that are about 32 inches long. Four that are 24 inches and four that are 60 inches or, or five feet. And basically I'm going to start it off somewhere around here. And hopefully end somewhere around here. Leaving me about 24 by 24 inches here for the for the firebox or the small little grill that I might put there either or I mean so so yeah about two joints have about six feet there left and should have about four inches left so I guess I did did calculate things pretty good then all right then well that's it for right now stay tuned once again, I'm using a square to score off both pieces of angle iron there. And basically, I'm just going to tack it on the outside and go from there. Put my squares in here. Looks pretty good. And I'm gonna repeat that on three more corners. And then I'm gonna put the pieces of two two feet sticking up on each corner. And then put another frame on top and that should be closer to finishing then. So as you can see I'm about to put the first piece that goes up and very important to have everything level and square it off. So everything squared off at the bottom and basically probably can't see it there but they're both pretty level got it clamped down and stuck a screwdriver there to work as a shim to get it straight for me so I'll be tagging it in place right there So once again we look and that one's pretty level there and focus and pretty level there too. So I'm about to go eat breakfast, come back and finish this little basket. And like I said I was going to do it six feet and um, I think five feet's pretty, pretty big anyways. So. All right, see you in a bit.
So we got the outside welded. Um, probably go back and do the inside or or whatnot. You know, pretty chilly right now. <laughs> Still waiting on breakfast. So pretty good. You know, so I got most of this already built. Now what I gotta figure out is where exactly I'm gonna put the cage or the firebox or I mean the <laughs> whatever the wood box or whatever you wanna call it. Probably gonna move it up to about somewhere right here. And then once I decide on that, um gotta trim back these angles over here so I can slide it uh, a little bit further further down and and then the angle iron from here is gonna go across from here to here and then weld onto the tank also. But like I said, I'm probably gonna move it about a foot and a half forward and, and go from there. So, all right then. <laughs> 